Today, we're going to cook sous vide duck breast with orange cranberry juice. Begin by setting up your water bath. Set the temperature to 55 degrees C or 131 degrees Fahrenheit. Place your rosemary and garlic in a Ziploc bag and set aside. I highly recommend using freshly squeezed orange juice, but you can use the carton ones from the grocery store as well. For the duck breast, we want to score only the skin in a crosshatch pattern, making sure we don't slice the meat. Doing this helps the meat cook evenly and prevents the breast from curling up. Next, season it with salt and pepper and let's prepare to sear them. Heat your pan over medium high heat, then place your duck breast skin side down on the pan. There is no need to use oil when searing as the skin has a lot of fat in it. Let it sear for about 2 minutes. When the color of the skin turns light golden, you can flip it and sear the other side. We only want to sear them lightly as we will sear them again right before serving. When you have seared all the sides, remove and place it in your Ziploc bag with rosemary and garlic. You don't need to seal the bag yet. Slowly submerge the bags into the water. As you do this, the air will get squeezed out from the opening. When all the air has been squeezed out, then seal the bag. Pro tip, you can use a bag of rocks to make sure your food stays submerged. So let's leave the duck to cook for an hour, and while that's going, let's prepare the juice. Add two whole cloves of garlic to the same pan you stirred the duck with. All the liquid you see here is the duck fat that you rendered when searing the duck. Once the garlic starts to turn gold, add half a teaspoon of flour and mix thoroughly, making sure there are no lumps. Add about half a cup of red wine to deglaze the pan, scraping any bits that may be stuck to the bottom. Add 3 teaspoons of cranberry sauce. 2 teaspoons of honey and your freshly squeezed orange juice. We're going to add some chicken stock concentrate. I got these from Trader Joe's but you can use the ones that come in cubes. Mix it in and let your juice simmer for 10 minutes over low to medium heat. You will end up with a consistency like this, where you can pull apart the juice to see the bottom of the pan. Strain it through a strainer and set aside until ready to serve. When the time is up, remove the duck breast. You can sear them right away or refrigerate them and eat it the next day. Just make sure you leave it out to room temperature before searing it again. But for now, let's sear it right away. This time, we will use a tiny drop of oil. We will also add the aromatics from the bag to give the sear more flavor. Make sure the pan is super hot and then add your duck skin side down, pressing down to sear evenly. Once the duck has turned a deep gold color, you can sear the other sides of the duck. Let your duck breast sit for 10 minutes before slicing. Then slice them into pieces for serving. I know that duck breast isn't something that people eat very often, but I really like the way it tastes and it's also easy to prepare in advance with the sous vide. Have you ever tried duck breast before? Let me know in the comments section below. If you like this recipe, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Good luck in the kitchen and enjoy!